Oh, welcome back, my faithful viewers, and we'll, we're going to do another review. Yay! So, uh, of course, we were shopping in uh, Costco, and this is their new chocolate collection. And, of course, here we are in the midst of all the entertainment and everyone going everywhere, doing everything. It's been so much fun lately. Yay! I just figured that maybe you might want to see what's out there, you know, um, what's good for entertainment, what's good for your little platters. So this here, this is new. This is chocolate mascarpone. Now, I don't know if you know what mascarpone is, but mascarpone is basically a very young Italian cheese. And they decide to make a whole collection of chocolate with it. Now, the best thing I like with these, especially the mascarpone, of course, a nice cup of coffee. Everything goes good with coffee. If you have an entertainment or you have a group over, you don't know what's this coffee, 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 coffee. It always works. Either that or tea. And if they don't like coffee, they don't like tea. I don't know, milk? Unless they're lactose intolerant, but coffee always works. Oh God, I'm such a coffee snob. Oh, but you did not come here to see me drink coffee. Even though I would love to do that. I wonder if I could do that. Come on here and just drink coffee, call it ASMR. Alrighty, so we've got three flavors of mascarpone cheese. I mean, mascarpone chocolates. We've got the ganache, we've got the tiramisu, and we've got the caramel. Ooh, oh, oh, so you don't have to eat them all at once if you did not want to. All right, I'm gonna start with the caramel back there. Okay, come on. So that's cute, okay. When it comes to packaging, you got the cuteness. And this is good because sometimes you don't wanna have the whole tray out. Let's see, I'll put you up here. Okay, and then we'll deal with the, this is the caramel one, yes. Caramel cream is in here. Let's go ahead and try and open this. Okay, this is interesting. How do we open it? Normally you just pop these open like that. Okay. Real life TV, people, real life TV. Okay. I tell you, they're in here good. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me I have to break the entire package just to get in here. Well, let me see if there's an instruction with this. Okay. Nope. No instructions on how to break into your candy. <laughs> oh my God, we got to break into our own candy. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. Okay, so it's a top like this. And then this is like that. And so it is. Okay, so we're peeling it like that. I like it. I like it. Ooh. Oh, I need to get a plate for this one. Oh, plate. <laughs> All right, I want you to see this because it has these cute little gold flecks on it. Okay. Do you see that? Cute little gold flecks. All right. Um, 
let's see. Mm -hmm. It is a solid piece of candy, so I'm just going to have to bite into it. I'm not going to be able to show you a cross section. I don't have a knife with me. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm. Mm. Okay. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 The shell is a little bit thick with the chocolate, but with the um, caramel cream, you have a nice dark chocolate shell. It is a, it's a substantial piece of candy. You're not going to get a cheap piece of candy. This is a good piece of candy. Oh, once you break the shell and you get to the filling, it is that soft, um, it's a soft, creamy kind of caramel. It's not like, it's not a hard caramel. Uh, it's very liquidy, very viscous, very delicious. Uh, it has a hint of, it tastes like a, a hint of coffee. <laughs> All because of the roasting. If you know how to make a caramel, you know that you want that nutty, you know, that roasted nutty flavor. So that's what you're getting with it. And I am very, very happy with it. So I'm going to put you back in there. And we're going to have a little fun later. <laughs> Next up, it's the tiramisu. See, now that I know how to open it, I'm just popping it open. It's not a big deal. And then we just get this up here. Oh, these are cute too. Now, this is a white chocolate, and this is supposed to have the cinnamon sprinkle, or, or go ahead. There we go. There you go. If I'm afraid if I tip it anymore, it'll fall out. But that's what it is. One bite. Mmm. 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 Mm-hmm. Oh, and the cream of the dessert. Oh, God. Mmm. You would think you were actually eating a piece of tiramisu. Mm-hmm. Oh. I like this collection up to now. I'm liking all three. I mean, I like the two I've tasted. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Um, the the cakiness of the lady thing. Mm. There's no cake in it, but it has that feel of cake. And the creaminess of the tiramisu. Oh my god, that is really, really good. Oh, oh this is wonderful. Mm hmm. Now, the last one the chocolate ganache. Oh, come on, you. Don't let me down. So this is the last one. 
And they're only around what? They're 56 calories for one. And it really does taste like the dessert. So, if you want to watch your portion, if you want to have the flavor, but you want to try and be somewhat good during the holiday season, this is a great cheat. This is a great cheat because it's like you can have, I've had three pieces of this with some, with some coffee and as an appetizer or, you know, to little pick to pick up the food before the main food gets there or if you already have food, you don't want to eat dessert, but you still want to pick up something. This is really, really good. So let's go ahead and show you the last one. So it has all that little powdery sprinkles. Now all that is part of the chocolate. It doesn't come off. These dots don't come off or nothing. They're actually part of the candy. So you don't have to worry about putting this on your table and then, then there's sprinkles everywhere of uh, whatever. It's not gonna happen. So here's the ganache. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's chocolate. Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh, wow. That's a lot of chocolate. Mm-hmm. You coming for me? My God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this, this set, if you, if you have access to Costco, oh, by the way, mm, if you have a Costco that has a restaurant, you're allowed to go in there and eat. You can go in there, you can eat. Now, after you finish eating, if you just happen to wander over to the grocery section, <laughs> what they're gonna do is stop you. And, um, or sometimes they have it that you can, oopsie, I'm gonna have to get that later. These are my slides that go to the projector. <laughs> These were the previous video, and I still love them. Life with the Logans. Great buy. Anyway, um, what would I say? Oh yeah, Costco. Uh, sometimes they give a, a like an honorary one day to try, like a trial membership. So you could say you're going in there, you try it out, yeah. And um. Or you can go with a friend because I can take my membership plus one. So if you go with a friend and you're accompanying them, that's fine. You can go and visit Costco. You could go eat at the food court. And if you just happen to wander over the grocery section, that's another way you could get, um, you know, to shop there and not have to pay the membership. Uh, you know, or you could get the free trial, which, they normally have. You have to ask for it. A closed mouth does not get fit. But those are the way that you could try Costco. Because if you could get your hands on these, oh, this was a good buy. So, till next time, guys. We're going to hope for the best. We're going to prepare for the worst. I guarantee you, kids, we're all going to end up somewhere in the middle. Till next time.